Hi everybody, uh, welcome to my channel. My name is Erin. Um, I've been wanting to kind of start putting up uh, art videos on YouTube for a while. Um, and so, Inktober came around and I kind of figured that it was the perfect opportunity. So, here I am, um, and here's my art. <laughs> Um, so my plan for Inktober is to kind of uh, set things off and let you all know what I'm planning on doing is to, you know, try to upload a video every day. Um, there are going to be a couple of days this month that I'm going to be out of town and I'm not planning on being able to upload a video. Um, I will still be completing the Inktobers, um, even though they might be kind of on a smaller side. <laughs> and I'm going to be posting them to my other social media account, probably Instagram. Um, but I'm not planning on doing a video on those days. Um, so, since I'm kind of new to this, I'm also planning on doing really minimal editing and my voiceovers and everything. Um, so that means I have some guinea pigs in my recording room. Um, if my guinea pigs start making noise, I'm probably not going to bother editing them out. So, I just want to apologize in advance for that. <laughs> um, but anyway, so that's my plan. So. Um, on to the art. Um, so I decided to draw a little Hermione and Crookshanks from Harry Potter. I've always been a fan of Harry Potter, you know, ever since I was a kid and started reading the books. Um, like, you know, every other human being. <laughs> um, but it was really fun to do. Um, a while ago, I think last year, uh, Corey Loftus, um, if you don't know who that is, I'll put a link to his one of his social media accounts uh, down in the description. He's an amazing artist. Um, you probably have seen Zootopia, and he did a lot of the concept art for that. So that's who he is. Anyway, um, so he did a drawing of uh, Hermione a while ago, and while I wasn't trying to like replicate that design, um, I did definitely have it in mind when I do this. So I just wanted to make sure to give credit where credit is due. You know, just in case anybody sees this and is like, you know, that looks familiar. So. Uh, that is what I had in mind. Um, but yeah, so I had a lot of fun uh, figuring out how to do the hair texture. Usually when I draw hair, I'm doing more of the like super shiny, silky anime hair. And it's usually kind of straight, so um, for Hermione's hair, it's supposed to be kind of bushy. I had a lot of fun trying to figure out how I was going to make it look frizzy, not like silky smooth and, you know, well-tamed and stuff. So that was really kind of fun to figure out. Um, but yeah, so I'll just let you finish watching the video. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel, and I hope you enjoy. <laughs> 